What's up guys, Black will be here and welcome back to Galaxy 2. In the last episode, we finished off World 3 and in today's episode, we're going to be starting World 4 with the Supermassive Galaxy and this Mystery Galaxy, which we'll find out soon enough when we clear throughout this entire galaxy. But yeah, but we're going to be starting out not with... Uh, this mission first, but the actual Secret Star mission, because, well, the Secret Star mission is on its way to the main mission, which is right there, but the Secret Star mission, well, you guys will find out. So the gimmick of this galaxy is basically everything else is really, really big. Like, ridiculously big. Super big. You could say super massive. Look at this Luma. Look at this giant Luma. We grow a big here, watch out! So that means big everything. Big Goombas, big Lumas, big, well, mostly, I say most of the coins are big. Starbits are big, thank God. Imagine collecting one of those. We're gonna wall jump off this coin, go across these giant pipes. Gotta watch out for some piranha plants, though. We gotta go up this pipe. Instead of down the pipe, we go up. Yeah, 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 I know how to long jump game. We got really, really ridiculously big swamps. Either way, these swamps will kill us. No matter what size, no matter what size, swamps will kill us. Oh, I like that boost there. Oh, here we go. Infinite lives trick. Okay, so let's try this out. If I can get this right, I'm a god. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. So if you want to, like, stock up on lives, go to this galaxy. And this is the easiest way to get lives. So if you're doing, like, the perfect run or anything, then you can just do... Then you could just go to this galaxy and just basically jump on this Koopa. And then you got yourself uh, a ton of lives. But now we're going to kill them because I need to move on. Boop. Um, boop. And there we go. Appeared. Ro oh, crap. I got to. I gotta charge my battery soon. <laughs> my remote's battery is getting kind of low, but luckily I do have a have a recharge. These are rechargeable batteries, which is something very common nowadays. Although I think most people don't get don't really want to use rechargeable batteries. Some people just want to like have like the regular like one use batteries. Oh, how did I time that well? Oh, smack him, smack him, right in there, thank you. Right in the money. Okay, so we're actually gonna not go into that launch star. So the objective here that we're gonna do is grow all these lovely, lovely flowers. Grab some coins, why not? We could use some coins. A lot of coins there. Anybody else? And there we go. That's going to take the vine right up to our star there. And let's see. Yeah, I'll take those star bits one. I like star bits. I like them clinkity clankity star bit collection sound. Alrighty, so we're pretty much back where we were before. There isn't really that much of a difference now that I realize. So, uh, now our objective here is to kind of just avoid some wigglers but I'm pretty sure all we need to do is just long jump and then oh wait for the traffic and go for it right to the star up the pull and BAM welcome to Flipsville, Flipsville Galaxy where there are trap doors and weird looking spike dinosaurs but apparently their weakness is the uh, underbelly, which I guess makes sense. 
speaking of underbellies, we're going to the going through the underbelly of this uh, whole little village, I guess. I actually like the idea of these enemies. Like you have to defeat them um, like this. I swear to God, the the first time I played through this, I actually like jumped off this entire planet. Like I legit died, and I was like, "No!" Oh, it's Captain Toad. What do you have to say? No scary monsters up here. I'm safe for now. Ah, Mario, I was just taking sure we're all clear. Ah, sir, we spotted a monster over there. I'm not gonna do my toad voice. It hurts my throat. I'm pretty sure you can skip this section. Although I think I might have to be Luigi for this. Oh, come on. No, 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 no. Okay, okay. Maybe not. Maybe I might actually have to be Luigi if I was going to skip through that section. Well. At least I tried. Even though there was some harm in trying. Bam. Bam. Alright, uh, let's grab... Can I grab this, please? Thank you. Ooh, that was close. Cool. Hey, give me them star bits. Alright. And now... Gravity's all... Flips... Okay. I was gonna say the. I was gonna make a pun and say that the gravity's all flip swapped, but uh. Then the freaking Octo Guma f hit me, and I was like, "You have betrayed me for the last time." Pretty sure you could just do yeah, you could just do that. I'm also pretty sure you could just do that and skip that entire section. And now we got our now we got a boss fight. A boss fight with the uh, queen of these enemies. I'm convinced that it's a dinosaur. This is definitely some kind of dinosaur. With a little tiny little tail. Look at his little tiny tail. It's so cute. All right. So like most uh, Mario enemies that have a ground that you have to ground pound, they somehow like have tattoos that specify like, oh, I have a tattoo on my belly that says you can ground pound here. <laughs> All right, ah, uh, bam. What are you gonna do? What could you possibly do? Oh, you gotta breathe. You gotta do your fire thing. Boom! Your hitbox is really wide. Like, really wide. Like, I get that you're big and everything, but your hitbox doesn't need to be your entire body, does it? Like, the entire underneath of your body. That's kind of ridiculous. Not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. So it seems that we were gone. So when we were gone, it seems that uh, Flipsville got a few uh, renovations. Took out the uh, the trap doors. Installed some uh, dirt holes, as well as these uh, mecha koopas, which is interesting. Not sure how useful they're going to be. Considering that, uh... I just pretty much... Yeah, I just went through that entirely. Not that much of a difference. Also, I could have completely skipped through this entire section. Now that I realize. Okay. 
So this planet, super easy to get past. Don't even need the spin drill. Because you can pretty much, now if I'm correct. Yep, I was right. Down the pipe we go. Now this, this area is a bit different. As in, uh, well, we still have to collect silver, the silver stars, but we also have to worry about uh, gravity change. And there we go. And the last one is right there. And hopefully I don't, I don't mess it up too badly. Okay. And that is the end of this episode, guys. So, if y'all enjoyed this video, please make sure to leave a like, subscribe, turn on notifications so you don't miss anything, and check out the description for some goodies. And I'll see you all in the next episode.